Okay, so one issue that I've been having recently while filming my videos is that when I'm filming, my chair is squeaking a lot. And to fix that, I asked my dad if I can borrow some of his w WD-40 or something. He used it. This is basically like a lubricant or something that you put inside of whatever and the noise will go away. Okay, so here's the chair turned over right now. So basically what I'm just gonna do is I'm gonna add some of this WD-40 on the edges of the chair. There you go, just squirt it all out and let's just let it drip down and hopefully that would fix my issue with the very squeaky chair. Okay, so this should look and sound much better now because the, the chair, the squeaking sound is gone. You can hear it. You can probably hear the chair, but like the the, the like the high pitch squeaks whenever I move around is no more. The WD-40 worked. And anyways, I hope you guys like this setup. Um, this is the first time I'm gonna be showcasing the setup for you guys. I'm not really showcasing. I'm just testing out different angles, which is I'm just trying to find a setup for me that's convenient to talk to you guys. And you know, I got a lot more videos to do. So you know, this is a good time to actually try and do the different setups. So this is my set up right now i have two lights with me both powered by outlet so you don't have to worry about their bar batteries dying out the only battery that i have to worry about dying out is the camera the camera's battery so yeah i mean quarantine might, is, might last for a longer time so gotta get my setup proper you know so basically on my right i have a yn216 um led light and over here i have a Godox SL60W. I am using an umbrella because it's so much cheaper. This is only 600 pesos for the umbrella. As for my audio, my audio is... I'm using the BY-MM1 microphone for the most part. And at sometimes I use the BY-M1 lapel mic ever need the camera far away and I need audio. So basically right now I have the Boya MM1 microphone um, connected to like a very long 3.5 millimeter cable to a tripod which is just off frame. It's just below me. You guys can't see it. But yeah, that is the setup I have right now. And look at this. It's not squeaky anymore. Isn't that amazing? Quarantine is a time for me to optimize my workspace and you guys should optimize your workspace as well. So um, I don't really have an idea for what this video is going to be about but i guess now that i'm talking about it it's about optimizing your workspace to fit you to fit to make it something that you'd want to go to every day because office is now home school is now home so make sure that you optimize your environment for whatever you do for whatever works for you and i don't want any clunky i don't want to move clunky stuff around so this is practically my environment right now um yeah i also have like a background stand set up in my room as well if ever i need to use that for a project i also have a piano in front of me actually there's a piano in front of me for my desk i have a dual monitor setup to make it easier for me to work on stuff as well as i have a wireless mouse a uh, uh, keyboard which is like smaller than the normal ones it's a mechanical keyboard i love it because it's small it's a blue switch so it gives me that tactile feedback it's the royal kludge rk71 and for my mouse i'm using the g304 ergonomics everything is all about ergonomics look at gaming chairs gaming chairs are bad for the back and it's very very hot yeah so ergonomics i have this good ass chair i have tables that are like 70 centimeters high which is the perfect height for me so whenever i'm gonna you know put my hands down it's gonna be all perfect nothing is gonna you know mess anything up basically so yeah this is practically my setup whenever i i'm at home um also guitar i have a guitar on my back so whenever you know i just want to jam out the song that i'm hearing i'm listening to also i am connect i have my system connected to speakers and headsets as well so Whenever I need to swap over to speakers and headsets, I have this program wherein I can, it's basically like a virtual mixer. So I can swap around whenever I need to listen to music on the headset or whenever I'm playing and I need to listen to my headset and whenever I need to use my speakers. Because when you're wearing your headsets for so long, it gets so hot and sometimes it gets so irritating. So that's when I switch to my speakers, which is good for watching movies, playing like casual games. These, um, Speakers are so amazing. Um, these are the 
Okay, so it's the Edifier 1280DB speakers. It's also Bluetooth, so whenever I go over to my bed, I can listen to music, just swap it out to my phone, and it is amazing. It is like a huge lifesaver. And as for my headset, my headset that I'm using is the Samsung, Samsung SR850, I think. And what's amazing about this, these are amazing when you're at home. These are open back headsets. So basically sound can escape from the headset. But what's amazing is that when you're in a perfectly suited environment, the soundscape is amazing. It's better than those closed back headsets, which muffles everything because air gets stuck up into your ears. And yeah, I also have an exercise bike actually. So, you know, whenever I feel like actually moving around i can use the exercise bike um yeah that's practically my basic work my basic workspace at home i just started speaking and that's what happened basically this video is now all about my workspace at home and yeah that is practically it um anyways um yeah so basically my main tips for you guys is every day in quarantine find ways to optimize your workspace to make it more convenient for you so it's gonna be easier for you it's gonna be much more fun for you it's gonna be less frustrating and much more easy to live with so that if ever things go online you're ready because you already have a place to work on also, it doesn't have the expensive. I promise you, it doesn't have the expensive. All the stuff I have here, most of it are secondhand. Like this table here, it's like su like those super cheap folding tables you can see on Facebook Marketplace. So yeah. Anyways, I'm going on a tangent now. Um, this is my second entry, I guess, for my um class. And if you guys like this video, if you guys enjoy this video, hit that thumbs up, hit that follow button, and hit that subscribe button for watching on YouTube. And anyways, my name has been Albert. Um, you guys have a great day for all of you guys who are sick or like going through something right now emotionally, uh, mentally, spiritually. I pray for you guys to have rest in your heart. And I just want to tell you guys that at the end of the storm, there is peace and calm waters. Whatever you're going through right now, I pray that you will get through that as smoothly as possible. Things might not be as easy for some people and that is the truth of life right now. And I hope that you guys are safe. You guys have food on the table. And yeah, once again, my name is Nin Albert. I hope you enjoy this video and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a great day, okay? See you guys, goodbye.